Welcome back. Over the past three videos, we have gone over the basics of building gameplay abilities with the gameplay ability system. I have talked to many of you, and it is great to hear how a lot of you are following along step by step. I want to reward you for your efforts, so I will be giving away a free copy of the Open World Server System Publisher License. The Publisher License will give you uh, access to all of the server software needed uh, to run uh, the server on your own hardware, so you won't have to uh, be connected to my web API anymore. And it will also license you to publish one game title. So here is the contest. <clears throat> uh, the, the prize will be, uh, as I said, one open world server publisher license. And uh, basically what you're going to do is be creating your own gameplay ability. And I will be judging the submissions and I will pick my favorite and they will be awarded the publisher license. <clears throat> so uh, just to make sure that uh, it's a fair playing field, there's a few rules. So you must be using the ODBS starter project as your base. Uh, you must also be using one of the Paragon characters as your character. I talked to a lot of you who picked something different than Sarath, and I thought that was cool. Uh, so you can use any of the Paragon characters. doesn't matter if you pick Sarath or not. Um, all animations, meshes, materials, effects, any art assets you use, animation assets you use, uh, in your gameplay ability must be from the free content provided by Epic on the Marketplace. Uh, to give you some ideas, all the Paragon characters have some, there's a lot of effects in them that are cool. Um, Severog's got some nice ones I've looked at. Um, there are effects in the Infinity Blade assets. Some of them are a little lower quality because um, of the whole mobile thing. Uh, you may find some interesting effects in the Cave Effects demo or one of the other demos that Epic's got, but anything that is, uh, you know, provided by Epic for free in the marketplace in the launcher is fair game. Um, to submit your entry, you must comment on this video with a link to your submission video showing off your ability. And you must do that by August 18th, 2018 at 12 a.m. to be eligible. So you got a little, little over a, two weeks. A little over two weeks. That should be good. And uh, the winner must also agree to provide the blueprints used to make their ability so we can add the ability to the game we're building in this tutorial series. That is assuming we can use it on Sarah. We'll see. But uh, we'll try to, get, try to get as many of the submissions in as we can uh, in a future video. Go through them uh, a bit more. Um, fine print. <clears throat> Um, if the country or locality you live in prohibits these type of contests, then you are unable to participate. Um, if your government imposes taxes on uh, winning of this prize, you're responsible for it. Uh, the prize is valued at 200 US dollars. And of course, the judge, myself, decision is final. Um, so there you go. Uh, you've got two weeks to come up with the most original or exciting ability and i i'm i'm can't wait to uh to see what you guys come up with i think it's going to be really cool um i'll be out of town um next few days and so the next video in this series will not be until uh sunday evening um okay until next time see ya